nearly fell backwards down a ladder. <sighs> Scary. Warning. These two came to see what was going on. I'd gone up into the attic in the garage and I was bringing down stuff for the garage sale and brought down these boxes and this was already here and there's this one big container same size as that but had a lot more stuff in it and it was heavier and I was like oh well you know what it's not too heavy I can just sort of ease it down the ladder well it got stuck and then all of a sudden it started coming at me this way and being as you know jerk reaction I was like I grabbed on to it instead of something that would have stopped me from going back so luckily it got caught and instead of flinging me backwards and completely off the ladder at like six foot high you know like I was ceiling height it stopped me and that's when I said Lord thank you <laughs> thank you for holding this container and not allowing me to die and then I negotiated it somehow back up into the attic and I said I got the hint Lord I'm gonna just turn off the light go back down and wait till Bobby gets home I got the hint because there is no way I'm gonna try to bring that down I killed myself so I almost died um, I, I don't think I would have died but I'm pretty sure it would have been broken back probably some wrists head cracked I don't know who knows what could have happened but I got this down and I have that I can go through, so I have stuff down here that I can, I guess, work on or whatever. So, um, yeah. Oh, that was scary. Scary start to my day. Scary start. Bam! That's right, I did have onions. I did have celery and carrots and chicken broth, so I can make my chicken pot pie. And that is what I'm going to do. All made. So proud, because it is very still warm and it's very thick so hopefully it will be nice and thick and the perfect consistency for a chicken pot pie so after it sits for an hour what happened to my wall why is paint chipped off my wall i frame hubby no it was him because it definitely was not that sleeping thing hey Hey. Ooh, stretchy. You're like, oh God, Mom, would you stop bothering me? Look at that face. One more time. There you go. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I accidentally forgot an ice cube fell out of the freezer. And I was going to pick it up fell on the floor and I totally forgot about it and it melted completely and then I stepped on it ah it's now my socks wet Arr. there it is the chicken pot pie and I used it all Woo, it all fit in there now to bake it cross our fingers and hope it comes out great <coughs> so just finished eating dinner. It was delicious. The chicken pot pie came out really well. To my, it wasn't as thick as I wanted it to be, but I think if it's any thicker, it's not gonna be good. Like it's still sort of once you cut it, it oozes the it ooze, but it was it was at a consistency where it wasn't like completely runny. It was like almost like hey hey hey. It was almost like a stoop. Like a stew soup, but not as thick. So, um, it's like an in-between. Anyway, so, I'm out of breath. And I'll tell you why. Because after we ate dinner and everything, I just exercise the cats. And I chase them around. I think I get more exercise out of it than neither of them do. And I only have to chase one, because then the other one follows, because he doesn't like the fact that we're running. So, I chase Baxter all around the living room and all around the house. You keep having to push him and make him run because he doesn't want to go. So 
like I said, I think I got more exercise than the cat did. But, yeah, so I did that, exercised the cats, and then uh, I'm going to watch some TV. Hubby is in the restroom. Um, and I think, I don't... I don't think we're doing anything tonight. I think it's one of those chill nights. <gasps> is it Wednesday? Ghost Hunters. 9 o'clock, baby. 9 o'clock. Ghost Hunters. That's where I'll be. Hey, so... Mom, look. The room is clean. Minus some laundry I gotta hang. Not iron. So, um, so dinner turned out really good. Chicken pot pie came out delicious. And um, all that good stuff. Um, we, hubby helped me get this stuff down from the attic, so, I mean, even then it was difficult, but I didn't kill myself. Um, and my eye is really itchy. Yeah. So, um, we got that down and washed out some more stuff. Um, the things from like 8 to 4, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, 8 to 4, and I can't leave work to put my stuff outside, so... We might only be doing it, I think, think we have to only do it on Saturday because there's no other choice. Um, the plan is to go out on um, Friday night, girls night, we might go to dinner at the o, in the O District and um, I think it's just three of us. So uh, we'll see, but um, that's the plan right now. And um, let's see what else. Uh, I fed the cats. Um, they did not get the treats, and they are not happy. Um, Bear keeps following me around every time I go into the kitchen, so I spent most of the day, or most of the night up here. Um, <laughs> speaking of the devils, um, so I watched Ghost Hunters and, um, watching... Some show Total Blackout that's after it, which is hilarious because I know I am entirely and completely afraid of pitch black darkness and I would be freaking out too. So, um, that's the thing. But tomorrow is Thursday. You gotta be kidding me. For real? Oh my goodness. So, yeah, tomorrow's Thursday and, um, another day, another dollar. Um, I don't know. I think we, if we want to have garage sale or we want to participate in the garage sale, we're going to have to go get signs. Um, I mean, even though it's supposed to be a whole subdivision, you kind of like, we live on a cul-de-sac, so not very many people would like know to come down the cul-de-sac unless people right at the beginning of the cul-de-sac had garage sale stuff. Um, so I was thinking if we got signs, we could put them at the end so people would know. But it's funny because like all we have is kitchen stuff. I'm talking like plates, dishes which are the same thing, bowls, cups, glasses, um, you know, uh, utensils, um, like crock pots and uh, blenders and coffee makers and just everything kitchen related. So we'll see. Um, I don't know. We might try to scrounge up some other stuff that we don't really need or use or whatever. So I don't know. But, um, yeah, so I think we might have to run out tomorrow and get that. And then we got to figure out how we would price things. Um, which is horrible because I don't do money at all. Because I can't do math. Even simple math. So that should be interesting. So, yeah. But hopefully we'll figure that all out tomorrow. And uh, that will be that. So I am going to get ready to go to bed. And I will...